Hello guys, I'm so excited about this video. So my baby girl, my best friend Han is turning 23 tomorrow and I'm throwing her a surprise party. She knows something's going on, I'm not gonna lie. She knows that me and Rach are gonna be at my apartment and we're doing something for her, but she doesn't know what we're doing and I'm so excited to plan this for her. So it's her birthday weekend. We've got a full weekend planned, which I'm sure she'll probably end up vlogging so you guys can like see what we get up to. But tomorrow Tomorrow night, I'm hosting my first party, which I'm so excited about. For anyone that's new, I moved into my apartment last week. Well, this last week? Oh my God, have I been there a week? Oh my god, I've been there a week now. That's so weird. It's gone so quickly. But yeah, I moved into my apartment last week and this is going to be my first little hosting event. So I'm very excited. And let me tell you, I go above and beyond when it comes to hosting. Even little things like when people stay over at my house, like I'm so anal about things but i'm gonna be hosting a sleepover and we've got all of our best friends come in so i'm so excited we've got matching pajamas we've got i'm actually making my own cake i'm making the birthday cake i was gonna buy it but i just feel like it's so much more personal and special if i make it fingers crossed it doesn't go wrong that's why i'm heading to my mum's now because i have no baking stuff and i feel like i'm gonna need jan's help here and there do you know what i mean but yeah i'm so excited to be hosting this i'm excited to throw her a party last year was kind of we did go out for her birthday but i feel like we didn't celebrate it properly so this year we are going all the way out especially because i thought our birthdays were going to be cancelled to be honest because of corona but yeah so i'm hosting a sleepover tomorrow night it's gonna be like a party sleepover we're gonna have some drinks we're gonna be playing beer pong we're gonna maybe watch films it's gonna be so cute so i'm gonna vlog the whole process i'm also gonna vlog like what i get her present wise because the present i've got her kind of want one myself i'll show you in the vlog obviously i'm picking it up today but her present is sick not to toot my own horn but like it is <laughs> so like i was saying i'm on my way to my mum's because we're gonna make her birthday cake and i'm gonna make like a pastel themed birthday cake i've ordered these really cute little butterflies from amazon which should have arrived now but i've ordered them to my mum's house so i'm gonna put some butterflies on there and i'm gonna make it into a proper birthday cake with like the um not confetti but what's it called like hundreds and thousands not that you know what i mean like the sprinkles that's what i was looking for sprinkles rach is in charge of decorations because she knows what she's doing when it comes to that i'm in charge of food and all that jazz so rach is obviously going to be helping me um she's going to come around a little bit earlier tomorrow as well to help me set up but yeah if you're watching han happy birthday i love you so much and i'm so excited for your birthday weekend it's gonna be so good i'm at home say hi mom hi mom's been doing her exercises that's why she's got little gym kit on but we're gonna start making the cake it's so weird being home now i wish i could have done this in my kitchen because it's just a lot like brighter and i could have put you on my little island but i just don't have any baking stuff yet so and I need Mama Jan's hands. I bought this to put like around it and inside it. And me and Mum were just saying we could genuinely just eat this out the tub with a spoon. It's so good. It's the vanilla buttercream. There's probably a million and one calories in this. Yes, of course there is. But oh my god, it's so good. Okay, we ran into our first hiccup, but at the same time, we've got a nice thing that's happened so i've just had these delivered off amazon and they're like edible butterflies because i i feel like hannah's got a butterfly necklace or something so i feel like she quite likes butterflies i don't know why i've got that in my head but han correct me if i'm wrong i do think you like butterflies so i ordered these off amazon and these are for the cake so i'm gonna have these kind of like going up the cake i saw kylie jenner's birthday cake had butterflies on it once and it just looks so cute so these are like edible little butterflies, but they've got loads of different like patterns and stuff. This one's really cute. This one's my favorite. Cute. Okay, so I don't know whether I mentioned, but I'm doing this four tiers. So this is the first tier. Well, first two tiers going in. I don't know if you can see it really, but it's got the, like the confetti inside it. Wow. So pretty. This smells unbelievable. It's like vanilla-y. 
Was that gross? <laughs> Oh my god, that was so good. My favourite part about making a cake, I swear to god, is like getting the ice, not the ice, and the batter out the bottom. I honestly have a newfound respect for bakers, cake makers, chefs, because I would just be eating the fruits of my labour the whole time. I'd be a million and one stone. This is the kind of cake I saw. I don't know whether you can see that, but it just had little butterflies on it and I thought it was so cute. So I don't know whether to just ice it. Oh, that's really zoomed. I don't know whether to just put white icing on and then the butterflies, but I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna make it up as I go along, to be honest. I'm not a baker and I feel like as long as it tastes good and it's got candles on the top, that's all that matters. The smell coming from this kitchen is unbelievable and look how cute they are so i don't know whether you can see like all the colors going through them but this to me is an actual birthday cake like when i think of birthday cake i always think of like confetti cakes but i used to have these in school these remind me of like primary school it's full nostalgia but they look so good. I'm so excited to decorate them, which I'll be doing next. So I've just cut around the cake and we're left with this little bit of a crust. And I'm very grateful for that because now I can actually try the cake and make sure it doesn't taste like, you know what? So I'm going to grab a little bit of the buttercream and a little bit of the cake. Sorry, mum's just put the kettle on. But this is what we've got so far. I'm just icing this little baby up and then we can decorate, which is gonna be my favorite part. This is a lot harder than I thought it would be because it just kind of like collects all the crumbs. But the taste of this cake is unreal and I feel like that is the main part. So can't wait to be having birthday cake for breakfast for the rest of the weekend. This, guys, is my little masterpiece. I'm just going to decorate it with the butterflies. We was going to do like the drippy effect on the top, but I just don't really trust myself with that. So I'm going to start decorating it with the butterflies and then this is going to be the cake done. So I don't really have a plan with them. I think I'm just going to kind of like do them going diagonally up, if that makes any sense. So let me bend them a little bit. And then hopefully they'll just kind of like set in the buttercream. And this is Hannah's birthday cake done. How cute is that? I mean, it's obviously not perfect. Like I'm not a baker out here. But I think for a first attempt, that's actually quite cute. So I've got the candles to go on top and I've got a little topper as well. So obviously it'll look so much better. But I think that's quite cute. Really quickly, does anyone else hear a song on TikTok and then just become obsessed with it? I'm listening to this one. I don't even listen to this kind of music, but I don't know why, I just really like it. It's the one where it's like, when am I right now? I'm gonna leave the cake at my mum's because her fridge is bigger than mine and I'm just gonna pick it up tomorrow while the buttercream sets. I do have to run into town to get Hannah's present as well, so don't really wanna leave the cake unattended. But on the list for today, I need to go and do a food shop. I need to, what else do I need to do? Pick up Hannah's present, pick up a card, and then I'm done and then the rest can be done tomorrow. I'm just going to pick up Han's present and I'm so excited to give it her. I know she'll love it. Um, I've never been able to like get my friends something like this before as well. So I'm just, I'm just grateful, you know, but um, I'm just heading there now. You'll see in a minute where I'm going. We're here. I'm so excited to give her her present. I'll show you in tomorrow's vlog because obviously I don't want to unbox it. So glad I ordered it online because they don't actually have any in store so played it safe and which I never usually play it safe I usually just wing it but I played it safe and it worked out so it's just been gift wrapped and then yeah hello guys I've just got home and I didn't go food shopping because I thought it's a task for tomorrow. I'm going to focus on cleaning tonight and then I don't actually know what food I want to get because I know we're going to order pizza, like we'll probably order Domino's or something. So I don't know what snacky bits to get, whether to get like fruit or cheese or hummus, like I don't know what I want to do. So I'm going to sort that out tonight and go tomorrow. 
I picked up Hannah's present, obviously. It's a little bracelet with a H on it. It's so cute, but obviously I don't want to undo the bow because I won't be able to redo that. Um, so I'll show you when she opens it, but that's her like main present. Went with this card, which says, you're so very special because she is a very special claw. So I'm gonna write that out, but I just realized I don't have any pens in my apartment, which is weird. Um, so got that, and then I'm also just gonna put this on the bag so she knows it's a present for her when she walks in, if that makes sense. So, something very exciting has just arrived. Matching pajamas. Yes, I told you, I when i'm hosting i go all the way out so thank you so much to pretty little thing for gifting these pajamas um we've got a pair for every girl coming so yeah it should be cute i'm gonna have a look at them actually i'm not actually seeing what they've sent but massive thank you to pretty little thing oh these are so cute i'm in your dreams and then it's just got some pink shorts. And then they've also sent over the Pretty Little Thing um, rompers, which are really cute. So I think we've got one of each. We've all got a matching pajama set and one of these like rompers each. So what I was thinking was I'm going to set all these out. So I'll have like the pajamas. And then Rach has bought these little um, like popcorn holders. So I'll put a cocktail, a little popcorn holder, the pyjamas, and I'll have like the names written on each person's. I'm so extra. I've literally just heard that out loud and realized how extra I, extra I am. Great. Yeah, I'm gonna sort all this out. Oh, also, I have this. Wait, where is it? I got like a little birthday sash that says birthday girl on it for Han obviously for Han. Um, and I also got, these were off Amazon, I think, um, some birthday candles. So these ones are like pastel -y ones. I'm gonna go make a cup of tea, start cleaning, and I'll probably just chill for the rest of the night because we've got a very, very busy weekend ahead. So, oh my God, I'm so excited now. So yeah. I can't wait to wear my matching pajamas. <laughs> Good morning, guys. It's today. Today is the day. I'm suddenly very nervous to host. I don't know why, because it's just my friends and they could turn up in a shed and be happy. <laughs> spent the entire morning, honestly, I feel like a housewife. I've spent the entire morning just cleaning. So the dishwasher's on, the washing machine's on. I've literally just cleaned the entire apartment. It's so spotless it's probably more spotless now than it was when i moved in so i've been working hard your girl's working hard it's currently four o'clock oh my god how is it four o'clock okay well the girls are coming at seven so i need to go and do my food shop which in hindsight probably should have just done it yesterday but oh well um and i need to get like things for over the weekend because the girls are staying all weekend so i need to get like breakfast and you know hungover snack got all of her presents and stuff in here so i need to write this card out just need to go and do the shop and also need to glow up because this is not delicious. I've also just put a little bit of bedding on this bed so the girls can stay over. Oh my God, look how I'm dressed. This is not cute. I've got little cream cycling shorts on, a pajama top from PLT and little flip flops. This is fully running errand attire. This is from Sisters and Seekers. How cute is it? It's like a little two piece. And then this top is just from House of CB and I've just got flip flops on. Like I never get about in anything but trainers. But today's a flip-flop job, like, I can't think about putting actual shoes on. I'm doing the food shop, but obviously I can't take this mask off, so I can't really film much. But I've just been getting bits of fruit for the weekend and stuff. I just don't know what food to put on, because we are getting pizza, so I just feel like a couple of nibbly bits should be okay. So I've somehow ended up spending £107 on food. Um just for tonight so I don't know how I did that I mean it is Marks and Spencer's but 107 pounds for that I mean I did get alcohol to be fair but still Miss Rachel is here Hi. it's all going off 
we've got this little thing that Rach brought. It's like a, what would you call that? Like balloon. Like balloon, but oh my God, it's so cute. And we're gonna have that on this wall so it's kind of like visible all night. Uh, Rach has got hands present and we're just blowing up these balloons. We've got some drinking games and all the food is going on this table, but all the food is out. So we've got this little dessert board, which kind of looks like shit now. So <laughs> we need to put some more things on here. We've got these, which Rach brought as well. Amazon. Like Amazon. Do you know what? Everything in this house is from Amazon. Like, I swear to God. Um, we've got some chips and dips. Don't know where the dips are. Oh, the dips are here. Um, I also have salsa, which we bring out. Um, alcohol alcohol in here too so yeah this is what it looks like before but i'm sure in a few moments it's gonna look different okay i'm ready i don't look like i'm meant to be at a party but i mean it's my house so and it's a pajama party so it's fine but i've just got this top on from asos i'll link everything down below if i remember but i've just got this top on from asos and joggers from adidas but asos Rach has been setting up. I think she's vlogging at the minute, so I'll go in in a sec. And honestly, this girl smashes it every time. Like, she is incredible. Let me show you what she's done. Oh my god, double vlog. Hello. Oh my god, Rachel, you've actually killed it. <gasps> is this beer pong? Yeah, but I'm just kind of decorative, obviously, all the shots are moving up. Oh cake. my god. You guys, I can't, I can't oh. wait for you guys to see how this cake because it's going there, and Mads is literally like. I made oh, it! Madison, <laughs> Ma Madison, Madison Berry! Berry. <laughs> oh my god, Rach, you've actually smashed it. Me and Rachel are going to do a little shot of tequila rose because I feel like that is necessary. So mum drops the cake off which is in there but I feel like we should leave it in there because it's kind of warm in the apartment. Yeah, put a few things back in the fridge. Yeah. Oh, I look nice and stocked up. Okay, so for anyone that drinks tequila rose, I found this out on TikTok. So this is how the bottle comes. Just, you know, standard tequila rose. If you put it in the fridge, when it's the right temperature, the roses go pink, so I don't know if you can like see the difference. But how sick is that? That's like the room temperature one, and this is the chilled one, so me and Rachel are gonna have a little shot because I feel like we deserve it. <laughs> I am so ready for a little drink, I'm not gonna lie. Look how many balloons there are on the floor. <laughs> and we've got her present station here. <laughs> we both do that the same time. Don't get me, I can't literally. Wait, hold on. I'm scared. Cheers. Okay, cheers to the birthday girl. Here we go. Oh, I haven't done one of them. Look. Oh my god, that is it's so, so delicious. Long. Look at Maddie's shot glasses. It's like a little pudding. It's what you serve like pudding things. <laughs> so I'm like, do you want to take two cameras? <laughs> so we just laid out the pajamas. These are all gifted by Pretty Little Things. So thank you guys so much. Our first blessings have arrived. Say hey, girlies! Hi. Hi. Hi! Oh my god, it looks so cute! Have you ever seen such a girl? <laughs> <laughs> it's just a joke. <laughs> it's literally like a proposal but with a bracelet. It actually is. We're getting engaged. I just really need this to get you a matching one. Can you turn it around? Wait, where's the hitch? Where is it? Oh. Hey, let me focus on it. Good. Christmas party. Oh, oh. Yeah. Like, <laughs> Wait, Rage, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Something I shouldn't. <laughs> I mean, moods. 
to be honest. <laughs>